Hey geeks, David Foster here, and I just took the stage at the Gibson tent here at CES Live 2015. Dexter and the Geek Beats is getting ready to rock out. Welcome to Geek Beat. Okay guys, so as a musician, one of the hardest things, like whether you're on stage or, or whatever, the process of tuning your guitar can be, you know, it just takes time and, and if you can't get your, you know, if you got humidity in the room or whatever, it can take a little bit longer. Uh, if you got new strings stretching while you're playing, it, it just, it becomes tedious and something that is, is, takes up too much time. So Gibson has actually come out with a technology where it self tunes uh, and can tune in like open tuning, standard tuning, and and I got Kyle here from Gibson, and uh, he's going to tell us a little bit how it works. So, Kyle. Yeah, how's it going? Good. So, tell me a little bit about how this uh, how this actually works, as uh, far as because the one thing I don't understand is how it can hear yeah. the tone out. So, um, the first thing I'll, I'll point out is that when you look at the guitar from the front, you can't even tell that anything's on the back of the headstock. Um, and when I turn this around, what you'll see. Um, is you'll see the G-Force unit on the back of the guitar. And what this will do is right here where my finger is, I'll turn this button on, um, this guitar right now is an open G. So I'm gonna go from open G, I'll go through some tunings in this bank. So you'll have open E, open A, open D, open G. One of the things I'll bring up on this beautiful 2015 Les Paul Classic that we have is we added this zero fret nut. This is adjustable too, so on top of the tunings, what you can do is you could turn this guitar into a slide guitar in a matter of minutes with just a little adjustment, which is really amazing. Well, yeah, and, and that's, that is amazing because a lot of times, you know, you have to pick up a different guitar in order to get the, the um, action that you want. Exactly, or take the guitar to tech if you don't know what you're doing, so now you can really just with a little tool, um, get that going. So I'll get back to the tuning though. So with this, um, I'll turn this back on. Um, I'll hit it again. And I, when I press down, this blue is also gonna be a user defined bank. So in this guitar, there's 12, um, 12 banks that you could put a user defined tuning in. So if you needed a little more than the 24 that's already in there, you do some funky stuff, you could really do that. Um, so I'm going to go down and this will be standard tuning. So we were in open G. What you're going to notice is as soon as I hit this, the tuners are going to move to get it close to standard tuning. So there they go. And now what I'll do is I'll just strum the guitar. And there those tuners go. So I'm just going to mute the strings real fast and just hit my high E string. And I just went from open G to standard tuning in about 10, 15 seconds, something like that. That is absolutely few, that's you know? absolutely amazing because yeah. you generally you know like if you're playing uh, like for instance when I played out I'd be playing open tuning or standard tuning then yeah. I got to go play a Black Crow song or whatever and exactly. got to go to open E and it you know you have to sit yeah. there and take the time to tune or, or you have two or three guitars with mm -hmm. you because the next song's Cashmere and you need mm -hmm. to have Dad Gad so and what's nice is there's some some tunings that go a little further than that that you know you don't normally use and it's inspirational because you want to learn a song you look it's in a, a alternate tuning and you go oh, I got to tune to that and you tune well and you may actually come up with your own custom tuning that you like yeah. that you know nobody else uses so yeah, and it's a it's a big year of innovation for us um, this is one of the things that that is coming on almost all the Gibson 2015 um, line and it's, it's very exciting innovative and like I said before, just inspirational for the player um, when well, you're learning. I, I gotta say, guys, it's it's about time that technology starts hitting the the musical instrument world because it's been ignored for so long and everything has kind of stayed the same for many years. And it, which is okay because of the sound thing. So you're not really changing the sound of the guitar. You're just like tweaking the the things that are the minor annoyances, I guess I would say, of of being a musician. Okay, Cal. So if anybody wanted to pick up one of these classics, where would they go? Uh, any Gibson authorized dealer worldwide. And is there a website? Uh, Gibson.com and there you can get all the information on all the innovations um, and improvements we've made to this year's Gibson USA guitars. Alright, thank you very much Kyle. See you guys later.